Today, EA dropped a 700,000 coin SBC, Ricardo Cavalier. The Chelsea here has been given some crazy play styles, which makes this card unbelievable. I'm adding him into a blank squad, and we are going to be putting him in a Chelsea past and present team. We're going to be testing this card out over three games in the past and present team, but if we lose any of those three champs games, this Cavalio card is going in an SBC. So it's super important I don't lose. Now, as the stakes are so high, this is 700k. We need the best possible past and present Chelsea team I can think of anyway. In goal, there were two options. We could have gone with Portois, but he only really has a gold card this year. But there is a team of the year. Head to check. Now, straight away, I'm feeling better. Check. Hopefully, it's phenomenal in goal. Now, I do want to have a little mixture of past and present players because when I built it, it was pretty much all past. But I do have a card which I packed during Ultimate Dynasties. I've only played one game with this card, but it looks absolutely incredible. Joining Cavalio at centre-back again is a Chelsea choice. I've got Diassi or Thiago Silva. Now, I feel like we're going to go with Diassi. He got this Pundit Picks card. Looks pretty good. I want to try him out. Let's put him in. But left back, there was literally only one choice. Ashley Cole. And that finishes off the defence. To be honest with you, yeah, that is very, very good defence. Probably need some chem styles, but Leachy sold all my shadows, so... I like it. Our central centre mid, Icon... Loan. <laughs> Michael Essien. He was always smiling until this year when he moved away from Chelsea. And Golo Kante. Actually, he's smiling in his flashback. Maybe it's because he's flashing back to when he was at Chelsea. Look at that. Three assists. When he played three games with him. What a card. The final it feels a bit of a letdown for this team because I just can't build a Chelsea team without Lampard. But all he has is this stinking card. So it looks like we're going to have to buy him. And I'm pretty sure he just, yeah, it's just like 69,000 coins. I can't do anything else. Hopefully, EA will give Lampard a juicy card that, you know, shows off how good he actually was in real life. The three attackers on the left. Think on the left. Finesse shot plus. Holy. Gianfranco Zola, team of the year. Not loan. Owned. Let's go. On the right. Probably shouldn't be in the Chelsea past and present team. But he's in this team because I just want to use him. I've not had the chance. I've seen a lot of talk on social media. Team Verna. Could have had Salah on this uh, right-hand side, but I had to discard my player in a month, so I don't have a better version. We've got one spot left, and there's only one man that can fill that position. Chelsea's best ever striker, Jackson. <laughs> no, I'm joking. Absolutely not. He sucks. <laughs> I'm so, uh, he's going to go on the bench, right? But yeah, no, Chelsea's best ever striker, DDA Drogba. <laughs> loan. <laughs> loan. Now, I, I couldn't find Mourinho on the game, so I brought in Benitez. He was the only Chelsea manager I could see when I was scrolling through, so he's a manager today. I've whipped together a bench of Gallagher, Caicedo, Thiago Silva, Mudrick, Sterling, De Bruyne, and Jackson. And that is the Chelsea past and present. Obviously, I've got Salah. And then I didn't put any of the women in because I wanted to keep it with like the Chelsea men's past and present for Cavalio. Now, have I missed anyone? Like, big. Have I? Makaleli. Other than that, I can't think of the time. We had Eto as well. I don't know. Let me know down in the comments below who I've missed. As I've said, time for three games of foot champs. If I lose any of these three games, Cavalio goes in an SBC, not discarded in an SBC. Right, it's time for game one. Let's have a look at our opponent's team. Wenka City. Oh, he's got Czech as well. Oh, okay. <laughs> well, we need uh, Drogba to... Uh... Go on, Droggers. Probably should have put us in the Chelsea kit. Yeah, I'll put us in a Chelsea kit for next game. Oh. <laughs> um. Yeah. Just so you know, I'm not telling you, Porky, that counts as one game. He's not played a game yet. But that's one, so it would be four in total after we get three wins. Chelsea home kits. 4K! Right, we've changed the kit. We're into game one properly now. And we're playing against a ladies well. Ladies well FC. Okay. Oh, he's got an 
team, two team of the years. Werner versus Werner. Probably should have put Kemstar in. Right, let's go. I'm not worried about the team defensively. I'm kind of just worried about the midfield going forward, maybe. Because, like, they're not very attacking other than Lampard, who sucks. Frank. Power shot. Oh, good effort. Oh, no. Yeah, no. Yeah, yes. Petter check. Close to 1-0 down there. This is a 700k SBC that I can't get back on the line. Right. Zola. Oh, he's in drug, but no one's catching him. No one's going to beat him for power. Drogba! Oh, I want to say. I'm going to go for the pass across. Oh, do you know what? That keep movement sensational. Free ball to Timo. 1-0. Let's go. Why is Lampard the furthest back when I've got him on balance tactics and everyone else on the stay back? Oh, Diassi, no. Yeah, this Diassi's really good as well. I don't know if he's still available via SBC, but he's great. I really want to give, like, obviously give a fair review of this Cavalio as well at the same time while I'm obviously playing a lot of games with him. Good win, Cavalio. That's really good defending. Looks into Drogba. One more. Yeah, Zola! <laughs> DDA makes it too. Skip the replay. Clearly not very happy. Go on, the boys. First game's over. After a super tough first game, it's time for number two. It's against Arsenal. Okay. Oh, my. Oh, my. Nope. I might be in trouble. Oh, my God. Come on. 1-0. No. Move, move the keeper to cover it. I hate this R1 dribbling stupid play, man, from kickoffs. What a win from Cavalio there. Come on! Oh, Davies going to outpace Reese James. It's through the keeper again! <laughs> Super Frank with the finish. Verde feels like he's got good feet considering he's like his composure is only 83, I think it is. Like, but feels really confident on the ball. Good knock on. And back in the Timo. One more drug bar. Near post. Come on! Oh, with your kickoff nonsense, man. Look at that footwork, man. DDA, go on. Drogba's been absolutely incredible. Why would you leave it at 6-2? He's gone then at 6-2, which means we've got one final game to save Cavalier. Now, I forgot to check my opponent's team. It just kind of skipped straight away. Well, I pressed it without thinking. Wasn't paying attention. So I have no idea what sort of squad I'm against. I don't know how that's not a foul. I was kind of annoyed he didn't, like, head it. But he, he must have won the ball with the tip of his toe. No idea, but great defending. Kind of sent Essien on a run here. Huh. Not sure how I feel about Michael Essien running through, but we'll take it. That post. Ho, ho! Don't know what happened. Brett, like... <sighs> Check's been outstanding. Other than the... He was outstanding in the first game. Terrible in the second. And then outstanding in this one so far. Zola, back in the burner. Oh, good save, Courtois. Good. Right, Drogba's on that back post. We've got to ping it across here. Right, knock down. Like, what? Here as well. Can't pass that. Drogba. Come on, composure from Zola. Don't tell me he's leaving at 1 0. Surely not. Oh, brilliant, boys. And that should be it. And then Gianfranco makes it too. And that is game over. Three games, three wins in the end. That was bloody tough. As you can see, I did play four games with Cavalio. He got an assist, which I can't remember. That is the final Chelsea team. Cavalio seems, obviously, I've only played three games with him, but excellent so far. Two clean sheets. I hope you guys have enjoyed today's video. If you have, please let me know down in the comments below. I can do more like players and then pass some presents around them. Thanks for watching, and I'll catch you in the next one.